This video is going to talk about how you can get that club more on plane on the downswing to produce a more neutral swing, but also to be able to create that stock shot that we always want. So the stock shot is the ball flight that starts right at the target, curves back towards the target line, but never goes across the line. This allows us to attack the pins and also manage our misses. So I've got today two drills that we're going to help with the downswing. As long as we've got things in place or we're in a good position at the top, this allows us to produce that. And it also then allows us to work out how to manage the club face to be able to get a stock shot. So the first drill is we're going to have, well, both drills are going to have alignment sticks, but the first one is going to have one here. This is at 45 degrees to the ground. And the idea here is we're going to swing underneath this as much as possible. So to set this up, we've got to get the stick level with our hands and we're going to take a big step. From there, that's where we're going to have the ball position and we're going to hit shots from here. So when you're taking the swing back and down, this club head works underneath this stick. This allows us to produce a club pass that is out to the right. And for me, it produces a six degrees into our club path. The other variation of this is we're actually gonna put it here and down the target line, really quite low. And again, that ball sits underneath there. And again, we've got to swing that club so it works underneath this stick to produce a club path, which is neutral, if not into out. So that was 5.6, so same again, into out. The two variations, it works best if you try both of them. Some people prefer the visual having the stick right in front of them. Some prefer having something out here. But having these two here pro provides feedback in terms of if we've done it right or wrong. If we've done it wrong, then we know we've swung over the top, which then can produce all sorts of swings. But if we keep repeating this, then we can create feels within our swing that when we go out into the course, we can recreate and re-feel what we, we have, the sensations to create this uh, and complete this drill.